Hello YouTube family. I've got just one quick recall to give to you for those of you who like to eat these and I did not even know they sold such a product. They're called kernel, apricot kernels. I always thought the seed inside of an apricot was poisonous but this says uh, this is found in food safety news first of all uh, breaking news for everyone's consumption and it was sponsored by Marler Clark it says fifth apricot kernel recall since March 11th oh my goodness this is only April 9th that's less than a month okay from the news desk on April 7th 2021 for the fifth time in two months March 11th, April, okay, whatever. For the fifth time in two months, apricot kernels, also known as pits or seeds, are being recalled because of elevated levels of cyanide that could lead to food poisoning. See, I was always told, don't eat apricot pits because they contain cyanide. It's a naturally occurring product. The three, that was me talking. All right, moving on. The three previous recalls initiated in Canada were posted on March 11th, March 17th, March 24th, and March 31st. Those recalls and one posted today all involved imported apricot kernels According to the recall notices posted by the Canadian Food Inspection Agency, the CFIA, the problem was discovered during CFIA testing. The new recall involves Chen Chen brand, dried apricot, north almond seeds. Chevalier, I think that's how you'd say that, Chevalier Star Trading Company LTD is recalling Chen Chen brand dried apricot north almond seeds from the marketplace due to natural toxin amygdalin. Consumers should not consume the recalled recalled product described below as it contains excessive amygdalin, which may cause acute cyanide poisoning. If you'd like to read the rest and check it all out, there's the brand, there's a number. It says uh, best before 12th of May, 2022. Size 170 grams. Uh, as of the posting of this recall, there have been no reported illnesses associated with the consumption of this product. They found it on testing. Okay, so anyway, that's all I have to say about that. If you really like to eat these things, uh, be careful because they all contain cyanide or that other thing they called it. Naturally occurring. Maybe some, for some reason, genetic modification, maybe, caused it to have too much. I don't know. But anyway, I'll say bye for now. I'll talk to you later.